My friends, I come to you with tremendous gratitude for the great work that we did together in allowing our capital campaign to be such a great success. We exceeded our goal in a very substantial way thanks to your generosity and your dedication to the works of the church. And so in the coming years, we'll be able to build endowments that will assure that our mission in education, in the works of charity, in allowing our parishes to be vibrant communities of faith can go forward. But now I come to you, as I do each year, to ask for your continued generosity in the current daily needs of our church, for those ministries continue to be in our midst and in need of your help. When I think about the We Stand With Christ capital campaign in contrast to the Catholic annual appeal, I, I actually think of it as uh, the difference between balancing of the daily needs to long-term aspirations. The contrast would be the way I think about, I have to budget on a daily basis for my monthly expenses. But I also have to plan for education in the future. I also have to plan for uh, retirement. And those are important aspirations, but they need to exist with each other and balance to each other. That as successful as the campaign was, our needs in ministry will always demand on an annual basis generosity from all of us for those needs continue to grow. The demands of modern life and all that we are challenged to address as a people of faith, those needs will never totally go away. So while my hope is and my expectation is that in the next few years, our annual Catholic appeal will diminish in the amount we will ask and need, nonetheless, I will come each year with gratitude and hope that you can respond as generously as you can so that we can in real time, in daily life, day in and day out, do the work of the gospel and meet the needs of our people. We got involved in our parish first because we really wanted to have the opportunity to encourage others to participate. We felt that the annual Catholic appeal was something that was important for all parishioners to consider. And we saw firsthand how much impact it could have, whether you're talking about the ministries of giving to those that are in need, giving to retired priests, giving to the seminarians who will then go on to contribute to our parishes. We thought that all of those were so important that we wanted to have a part in encouraging others to give. Yo apoyo la campaña católica anual por la gran necesidad que existe en nuestra diócesis. Nuestra diócesis tiene varios programas de apoyo a nuestros inmigrantes, a las personas indigentes. También apoya los seminaristas, que es el futuro de, de nuestra iglesia aquí en nuestra diócesis. And I think another thing that was important for us is to help the parishioners at our parish to understand where the money for the annual Catholic appeal went. The important thing to keep in mind is that the Catholic Church feeds more, clothes more, and educates more people on a daily basis than any other organization in the world. And frankly, that takes a great deal of resources. We view it as an opportunity to be able to contribute to that overall cause and to help humanity in so many ways. You may not believe it or think it, but there are many people in need right here in our own communities. And by giving to the annual Catholic Appeal, you can help feed the hungry. You can help give a Catholic education to kids that are in need. And we can also help prepare young men for the priesthood and also to support some of our retired priests and help them out in their spiritual journey through the rest of their lives. Jesus set a standard for how we care for one another that in my mind really changed the human race. And here we are in Fairfield County really living that faith in a very real basis. We've chosen the theme of renew because through the resources we have in the campaign, the resources we will raise in this annual appeal, and the spiritual gifts that you and I bring together in our parishes and schools, we are moving forward as a church. Our task now is to continue our renewal, the renewal already in our midst. One of the things that we keep in mind is imagine if every person in our diocese 
would donate to the annual Catholic Appeal and thinking about all the lives we'd be able to help through the various ministries. You and I can bring a message of reconciliation, of hope, of renewal, of new life within our communities and to the larger community we share with our sisters and brothers of every faith and way of life. Giving within your means is so important. We are called to give by the bishop and by Christ. And this is an opportunity we have to fulfill that calling. They were really helping to carry out God's work and most importantly, helping to carry it out right here in our own communities. And so I thank you. And I ask, as always, that you be as generous as possible as you and I together do this work of renewing the church in the hope of renewing the face of the whole world. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. As chair couple of the annual Catholic Appeal, we'd like to thank you for your support. Thank you. Thank you.